This Office Mix is going to talk about what is new in the Dynamics AX user experience. For all of those people that are on CTP7, it will show you what you will get when you upgrade to CTP8, and ultimately what you will get when you upgrade to the February release of Dynamics AX. Workspaces are a new concept for AX7, and we're very excited about the many workspaces that we have. Workspaces are designed to be the place to go to perform an activity. They provide insights about the work that you have to do, and they allow you to act upon those insights. One of the best new capabilities we have now with our workspaces is we now have the ability to personalize those workspaces to make it fit your specific needs. So in this case, I'm looking at the sales order processing and inquiry workspace, and I've noticed there's a couple tiles on here I really don't think are providing much value. I have this partially shipped and this confirmed tile. So I'm going to simply remove them. I'm going to right click on partially ship tile, click personalize, and say I want to hide that. I'm going to right click on confirmed, personalize it, and say hide. And so now I have my dashboard only showing the tiles that I think are useful. Okay, now let me demonstrate how I can add additional tiles to a workspace. So in this case, I'm going to drill in on all customers because I want to add a different view of customers to this workspace. So now I'm on my customer list. I'm going to filter this list down to see only my wholesale customers, which are customer group 10. I apply that filter and I now can come to the options tab and say I want to add this to the workspace and I'm going to choose the sales order processing workspace that I was just on. And I'm going to choose to represent this as a tile. I would also have the ability to pin this as a list, but in this case I'm just going to put it as a tile. And then I have the ability to name what that tile is going to be. So I'm going to say wholesale customers and I want to show the count on that. And then now I can go back to my sales order processing workspace. I can refresh that page. And I should now see a new tile that shows me all my wholesale customers sitting right next to my all customer list. That's an example of how you can add a tile to an existing workspace. Note I could have added that wholesale customers as a list that would is displayed within here as well.